So in this question, we're given this uh, velocity function, and we're asked to find the maximum acceleration. So first thing I'm going to do is to find the acceleration function, which would be the derivative of the velocity function. It'd be 3t squared minus 6t plus 12. So I need to find the maximum of that. Now the trap here is that you take the derivative of that, set, e set it equal to 0. And if you do that, you'll see that will be at t equal to 1. And if you compute this at t equal to 1, you're going to get 9, which is actually uh, is the relative minimum. Because if you do the second derivative, it's positive, which means that's a minimum. We need to find the maximum. Um, so you can either compute this at the ends, or another way is to uh, complete the square here. So for example, if I factor out a 3, t squared minus 2t plus 12. Actually, I'm going to just pull out a 3 from everything. And that's t minus 1 square. I'm completing the square here. And uh, we're trying to maximize this, so obviously I'm going to use the largest value for t, which is 3. And that's going to be 3, because this is square, it's always going to be positive. Um, and you'll, you'll see that t equal to 1 is actually the minimum, because this would be equal to 0 in that case. So that would be 3 minus 1 is 2, 2 squared is 4, plus 3, 7 times 3 is 21. So that's the maximum acceleration. You can also graph it, but either way, answer is D.